Mega Gaming Crew, so now I'm unknown tar, so welcome back to the stream. So in the stream, we are going to talk about GTA 5 RDR 2. First, we are going to talk about GTA 5. So let's get into the live. So let's get into the live. Okay. Don't leave us all alone, Michael. Please. Oh, you are bad. Alone. Yeah, that is a happy place. Okay, we are going to go to the live. We are going to go to the live. Okay, that's it. Hi. Ah, uh, you're once again. Ah. Uh, Irda. Okay. Okay, stream called you, but you can't be Okay. okay. Okay, okay guys, so let's go to the stream. Let's go to the mission. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go to the full screen. Ah, there's a window. Apply changes. Okay. Ipa pola nampak live kula pola. Cerang aku malah nama mat pot karet pon. Mat vehicles, saved vehicles. Enna karet pon. Phantom, Harley Davidson, Ferrari, Lambo. Cer inda karet pon super karet de. Doc, hey. Michael. I'm looking through my appointment book and I. What a comedy piece. It's wrong by mission. Hey, what are Okay. Mission. Okay. 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 Let's go to the drift. Let's go to the map. Let's go to the R.D.A.T. map. Franklin. Franklin is not Franklin is green. Oh, okay. Let's go. Guys, we are going to go to the live R.D.A.T. Let's go to the R.D.A.T. Driving karma is coming from the keyboard. The car was pitching to go to Yeah. 
எப்படி இருந்தாலும் நம்மளுக்கு தேவை சேதார ஆயிருக்கணும் அவனுக்கே சேதார ஆயிடுச்சு I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. Skip any long. Huh? I'd offer you something, but you were just leaving. Okay, chiru anga nam mulla vella po. As much as I love catching up Vaanga ketta poma vehicles saved vehicles Oh Lamborghini Come on spawn Ayyo Come here spawn here Excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something I don't know. Geeky. You chera. Na tadgrao. Eat to bros. Okay. Yo vlog kaas irukku namukitta. Idha thavaya. Idha or nalla eh nalla irukku. Okay. Okay. Yes. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Bye. Thank you. Okay, super this. I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the lamp. Oh, interview. I'm going to interview the Rolls Royce. Phantom. Okay. Come on. I'm going to go to the Rolls Royce. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Hey, you hit me! Ok, 
building. I'm totally becoming a tech evangelist when the big boys not test. Follow up on Maybe not even tech. I'll evangelize anything, even evangelize it. Bag. Marcus will be right Hi, out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Keep calm and carry on sharing. Okay. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Ah, uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. There it goes. Might I tempt you with some organic chow or a fair trade java? We'll get there eventually. Rocking out might get you in the right headspace. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, mine's are Send me the Dude, when it blue screens again, you're my guy. Bye now. Sit, 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 sit. Foot bang, dig fast. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Oh. Oh, Some. A hole drank my effing hemp milk. There was a totally non passive aggressive note on it. If I drown in mucus, it's your fault, you illiterate effing seas. Stop. Yoga zona. Ah. 
Oh my god, you guys are so lame. Out. No, I'm... And tours around the country before disappearing. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Chitty. Hey. This company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Carolina. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. Okay. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. Chera. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Today, right here, we're about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. Dock, dock, dock. Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to dock with me. Hello? Oh! oh ah. security. Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 Let's... no, 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 no. Whoa! Heavy, you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till cl- Now 
Yeah, Rana. Yeah,
ಒಂಥರಾ ಮಿಷನ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಗಾಯಸ್ ವೇಟ್ ಮಾಡೋಣ ಗಾಯಸ್ 1 ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿ ಆರ್ 2 ಹೋಗೋಣ ನಾವು ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮ್ ಬಿಟ್ಟಲಾ ಉಳ್ಳ ಪೈಟ್ ಇರ್ಕಿದ ಆರ್ ಡಿ ಆರ್ 2 ಕ್ಕೆ ಉಳ್ಳ ಹೋಗೋಣ ಸ್ಟ್ರೀಮ್ ಬಿಟ್ಟಲಾ ಯಾರೂ ಪಾಕ್ರೋಂಗಲ ಡಿಸ್ಲೈಕ್ பண்ணಾನಾ ಓಕೆ ಆರ್ ಡಿ ಆರ್ 2 ಕ್ಕೆ ಹೋಯಾಚ್ಚು ಸೋ ಇರಂಗ ಪೈಟ್ ತಲವಳಿ ವೇಳ ಬೈಕ್ಸ್ 
ஃபோட்டோஸ் கேப்சரு தலைவலி கொடுக்காத இப்போ போயிட்டு ஆட்டோமேட்டிக் போயிட்டு ஸ்டீமில் இருக்குது ஆர்டி ஆர் டூ டன் கொடுத்துட்டு சாரி காய்ஸ் கொஞ்சம் அட்ஜஸ்ட் பண்ணிக்கோங்க இது ஏதோ பக் ஆகிட்டு இருக்குது சைட்ல மட்டும் ஏதோ வருது ஸோ அட்ஜஸ்ட் பண்ணிக்கோங்க அப்போது கேமுக்கு போயிடலாம் சைட்ல என்னமோ பக் மாதிரி வருது ஸோ அதை மட்டும் என்ன பண்றதுன்னு தெரியல ஸோ மடிச்சிருங்க லைவ் பார்க்குறவங்களா லைக் பண்ணிக்கோங்க ஷேர் பண்ணிக்கோங்க மறக்காம சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணி பெல் லைக்கோ நாளில் போட்டுக்கோங்க ஆளில் போட்டுக்கோங்க ஒரு தப்பு பண்ணிட்டேன் காய்ஸ் டிஸ்டர்ப் ஆடியோவே போடல இப்ப கேக்கும் உங்களுக்கு
Fireworks can't be in Calm camp. Down. What it up, what it up. Yep. Arthur, Arthur. What now? You sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. I'm not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. <laughs> Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. Charles, around Charles, not Charles. Charles, I need you for some business in town. Okay. Come on. Okay. Sorry, Makale, I didn't know. There was a side lane, and more was there. This side view, Mary, was there. Okay. I didn't know. 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 I didn't Where are we going? Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney about these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Okay. And you're deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. As soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was gonna play him like a fiddle. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Hey, wait for me! Me, please. Now, as I was saying, on the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. Hmm. <laughs> so, spirits seem good in the new camp, I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. Ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but. Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Cinematic Trelawney. I've only met him a couple times, but he's... He's a strange one. Okay. Fear not. He's just a cockroach in fancy britches. But he gets into nooks and crannies the rest of us can't. Yatar Kampa, enemy our team at our team. Whoa, reckon it's that one with the fire outside. Let's take a look. Someone got here first. So it seems. By the looks of things, it wasn't a social call. This food's barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. What do you think? Uh, Dr. Skilgore Mining Company, this is to certify that is the holder of shares, including the above company's Found anything? The provisions of the Mermont and Articles of Association. Thereof and that the sum of one dollar has been paid on each under such a secretary. Okay. You see anything there? Nothing. Hey, dryer. Such people. No hard slam, would it? Snake oil. 
Big struggle. Pretty recently, I'd Look, say. I guess tracks. maybe uh, 12 hours Come ago. On. But no body? Not yet. There's some blood here. That ain't good. Idiot. Hmm. They went down the path here. Tracking these days. All right, I guess. Hmm. Well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place I'd expect to see Trelawney staying in. No? Normally scams himself into the best hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean after the bar fight, where? He talked the whole way and never actually said it. Thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. They could be 20 miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends on how much you want to find them. Yeah. I still ain't sure about that. Hey, look. They continue on the other side of the tracks. Okay. These tracks lead into the forest. Lead this way. What are you getting off for? Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen him? <clears throat> we're uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. <laughs> You seen a strange sort of fella, sort of. Life formal. Formal. Like when you go sharp, 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 you stay there. Uh, where is Trelawney? I don't know anything. Tell me where he is. You go to hell. Tell me now, you son of a bitch! Okay! Okay, for Christ's sake! They took him to a cabin. Over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left! Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. Well, that's that. All right. That should do it. Come on, let's go. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, then. Yeah. 
You okay? I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. I mean, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. Must be it. Whoa! <laughs> Let's get you out of here. Come on, boy. The thing is, after that oh. sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Uh, uh, is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're uh, alive. Allegedly. Uh. Dumped his gear. Look around. He can't have gone far.
He's mine! Let me take him. Let me get out of here. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. Come on. You should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Thank you. Ah, the gunshots are coming from that barn. Come on. He's backing off inside. Get after him. You all right? Yeah. Never goes easy, does it? Sure don't. Come on. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery feller. <laughs> Guess we'll soon find out. Seems like we can't catch a break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> Sure. What's government agents and bounty hunters to us? Ah, I hope you're right. So, who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole oh. Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. No, but no. There always seems to be more. More no, no, and more job. civilization. I want to get back in the open country of the West, or what's left of it, but even that ain't the way I remember it. Hello, 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 hello. Voice too low. 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 Share putting on Markham, subscribe and like an all up to go. The mission of Ripo. The grave family is in the ground. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. 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 Ah
பாகியா இருக்குது கிரே ஃபேமிலி கொண்டோமா ஓகே ஹார்ஸ் ஃப்ளஷ் ஃபார் டின்னரா See about some horses? Horses? Yeah, we had a, an appointment with Mr. Braithwaite, I believe. Yeah, I never heard about any of this. Our partner wanted to make a significant investment in some stables down here. But perhaps we should look elsewhere. Well, I... Okay, then. Let's head on up to the stables. Someone will come see you. That's it. Nice and easy. No need to rush. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. Stables just up ahead. Heads down, play cool. Head around the front, hitch up there. Uh. 
All right, let's hit you up here. Let me do the talking. Hello there. Can I help you boys? I hope so. Heard you got some horses. We always got horses. Fine horses, I mean. I don't get you, friend. Yeah, you do. Come on. Listen, why don't you get out of here? You, Scarface, and your greaser buddy. Whoa! I don't like officials. We ain't officials. We're connoisseurs. Looking to do some breedings. Come on now, partner. Okay, fine. Follow me. These here's mainly the studs, available for purchase or for working. If that's what you're interested in. What is you boys interested in? We represent a famous uh, stable and stud farm from uh, Saratoga. Is that so? Unofficially. Of course. This here's Cerber. Uh huh, greaser, huh? Okay, bandana's on. Don't need nobody recognizing us. All right, I'll grab the white one in the middle. You get the other two. <laughs> Relax, boy. Come on. Good boy. Okay, tough guy. Easy now. Easy there, easy. Marston, you're gonna tether him up to Javier's horse. Okay. Javier, you're gonna lead the stallions. Hey, easy now. Easy there. Easy. You're okay. It's all right, boy. Easy there. Wait. Marston, you ride point. I'll cover up the back. If there's any problems, we'll regroup at Clemens Cove. Okay. What are you doing? Let's go, quick! Get going, you two. I want What the hell are you doing? Stop! Stop! We're being robbed! I said stop these men! Stop!
You got him. Well done. Clemens Cove is just over there. Come on. Come on Let's get this over with. Well, that could have gone smoother. That'll be on my gravestone. Come here. You think they look like they're paying 5,000 for horses? I guess we'll see. What you boys want? Heard you was, uh, heard you pay good prices for horses. Oh, we'll buy more or less anything, Pop. That so? Sure, Pop. I'm Clay Davies. That's my brother, Clive. We're twins. John, Arthur, Javier. <clears throat> so what are you, Cuban? No, I don't like Cubans. Believed a yarn spun us by one of that Gray family and imagined we was going to be wonderfully rich. <sighs> At the end of it, we felt like prize idiots. think I'm just some effete buffoon. What? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I've found... This friend of yours. Roads. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. You sure seem to have got about around here. You know me. I like to make friends in low places. How the hell you end up down here anyway? I could ask the same of you. I have a few commitments over this way. Some expenses ah. to me. You're too far ahead. <laughs> So, like you were saying before... Expenses? What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats? We just ride together. <laughs> so you was just talking about something? Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent returns for the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the law. Yeah, that's how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I'd done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know, you boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. I tried to mention it to us. Okay. Hunger, we can reach 10, 10 likes, 10 likes, Hunger, 10 likes, reach for now. Live Pakarong, like Punikonga. But like in the live, we can reach for now. So, where exactly are we going? The train station. The clerk there, Alden, is quite a fellow. Very informed on the comings and goings of coaches around these parts. Ah, I see. Easy. 
Here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. Get me home. My God. Oh, gracious. Hello, Alden. Hello, Joe Zah. How have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The witness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Martha. He's one of us. What the hell was that? I thought you might like to see that of mine. Time to go, boy. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. What lovely weather. Okay, let's go. This way. Can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry. Could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to strawberry after all that market business. Didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble. You gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. Here we are. This is the spot. Okay. There it is. Right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. ahead and get the coach to stop. You hang back. 
Don't let them spot you or you'll scupper the whole thing. It's a free country. <laughs> Did you say a show? <laughs> it's a small benefit. An opera house. Blackwater. Did you say? Mrs. Chester Danson. <laughs> flatter me. I flatter? Nobody. Oh, stop the coach, my good man! Stop the coach! who believe Westerners don't know anything about culture. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> would, could, could you? It's, it's such a small show, but... <laughs> would you sing something for me? I, I'm looking for a mezzo-soprano. Well, I, 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 I don't know. Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. I have your card. The event is on the 23rd of this month. I can't say enough. Uh, Mrs. Damson. Magnifico. So sorry, gentlemen, for the interruption. Farewell. Well done, sir. Well done. It was easy. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, it's always good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Sound are not the same guys. My cough is not the same. So, if I can't punch, so if I can't speak, speak. Yep. Okay, come and sleep. Hello, da. hello, hello. My love is the same. I'm going to speak. 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 I
So, I'm going to talk about it. Okay. Like, share, and subscribe. Let's see if we can see this live. 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 No, one like that. One, one, one like that. Only one like. Manga Makkal is rich. One like. One like. One like. One like. One like. of tobacco. A gentleman <gasps> to see you, ma'am. So, <gasps> your friend, the other liquor vendor. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Hello. Arthur, welcome. We're just welcome. playing privilege. Arthur Morgan, mm. this is Catherine Braithwood. Nice to see you again. Apparently. So this one, he is big and as dumb as he looks? Well, he's surely big, but Cards his intelligence is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is Skip as dumb as he looks, but I think... Hop on, we'll fill you in on the way. No, I'm driving. Fine.
Ready? Let's get out of here. You for Christ's sake. You was quiet in there. Took everything I had. That son of ours. I'll shove that silver spoon down his throat and pull it clean out of his ass. A smug fucker. Okay. What the hell are you doing? You can't. So what's she got here. us doing at the Gray's place? She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. Moonshine? Horns faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fit. She did. Not I'm thinking this hell about I toy fitting my boot up your hook. No, just snotty old bitch. <laughs> Jose you really picked the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Ah, he was giving his usual flannel. One of these families got gold stashed somewhere, he reckons. I mean, I'm off for sticking it to rich folks. I hate rich folks. They really bear me some bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he though? The master finagler of nothing. Easy, easy. So far, we've destroyed the Braithwaite still. Tried to sell the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand, which I'm very much looking forward to, by the way. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. We just robbed their horses, too. That was you? Jesus. So, we're just gonna drive on in there, is that it? Don't worry, I got a plan. Wagons go in and out of there all the time with supplies, equipment, payroll. Especially now they've taken on all that extra muscle. We're making a delivery, that's all. Just leave it to me. I can talk a dog off a meat wagon. <laughs> all right, then.
Yeah. Stop shooting, you crazy bastard. Yep. We're never gonna get there at this rate. Drive on the road for Christ's sake. the pace here. Listen, we're tired of trouble and do some work.
Them greys, English. Excuse me? You've not worried about them greys. In what sense? Well, they know you. Yeah, maybe you're right. You know what? Here, I'll go hide and back. If you can act naturally and stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> I'll do it all. Hey, hold it right there. What do you want, boy? I've... I've... There, there was a thing... A, a thing... At the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? H here. Uh, 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 have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean you no harm. Uh, <laughs> I I've come from Donegal in, in Ireland. You don't say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I, I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions. I'll tell you no lies. Uh, sort of business. Uh, uh, before the officials got there, okay, they said. Okay. Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink, Sean. <coughs> Hamish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> uh, fine bit of country you've got here. Uh, not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Is that right? Then you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Just over here. Yeah, it's straight down the path here. It's getting so I can barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, and they said they was looking for more drivers in town. I jumped at the chance. I ain't never been a feather to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. Bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. Disgusting. Oh dear, oh dear, I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Just in there. Ah, right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> uh, quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy places they was, Hamish. Real fancy. Because if some folks got all the money, they can build quite the fanciest places imaginable, eh? Mm. Well, the average... <coughs> okay, you can hold up in here till it gets dark. How you getting on? Good. Nearly got these things ready. Okay. There's plenty of guards out there. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. 
You head over to the dry barn. Sure. Quiet. There's someone coming on the left. wagon already arrived this one didn't strange so what you got there tools payroll okay drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields sure see you later you hear that payroll yeah let's get this job done first okay we'll take care of this fella You douse the fields, I'll meet you at the barn. Try to stay out of trouble. It's gonna be a long night. Someone coming on the left. Ha. Oh, hey. Well, I, I thought the wagon already arrived. This one didn't. Strange. So, what you got there? Tools, payroll. Okay. Drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields. Sure. See you later. You hear that? Payroll. Yeah. Let's get this job done first, okay? I'll take care of this fella. Meet me at the barn when you're done. Shine them fields up good, all right? You head down. for here.
knows I was seeing things. Give this a quick dousing as well. Think she'll go, Arthur? Line her up. After you, so. <laughs> Woo Would you look at that? <laughs> now let's go light ourselves a fat cigar. We'll deal with these fellas. You keep order. You ain't leaving here. Stop shooting, you son of a bitch. Somebody shoot him already. Got the horses from the table. Come on. Not right now. We got company. Look out.
turn into a right party. You call that a party? That break weight had got our money's worth, all right. Let's just get out of here first. Yep. Quite a night. Sure. Interesting little fight Duchess put us into the middle of here. Uh, I hope him and Jose are right and that there's some money at the end of it. Well, what now? Head on back to camp. You coming? Later. I, I got some business. Right you are, English. Another job well done, I'd say. Next live, so we try lunch. So bye. See you on another live.